Hi, Alan Stratton from Maswood Turns. A few days ago I made a video where I presented a bowl that I had actually rough turned several years ago and made, left to dry. In the meantime, it developed a very large nasty crack extending clear across the bottom of the bowl. In the video, I asked for comments and suggestions for alternatives in dealing with the situation on this bowl. I'm very pleased with the number and the response that has been received, and I thought it was worth making a new video to talk about the alternatives that were brought out in this process. They fall in my mind in three major groups. To conceal the split, to accept the split, and to emphasize the split. So first with the conceal, these are perhaps the simplest ones, would be essentially to use a fill process that blends. You want to hide or conceal the fact that the split ever happened. So we'd use a filler of putty or sawdust or with uh, CA glue or epoxy or uh, casting rosin, but the main idea is to blend it in so that it would not be noticed. Or, to go even more drastic, you may replace the wood, but again, here, if you route or saw out the split, the idea would be to replace it with a piece of matching wood. Making it even more drastic would be, one suggestion was to actually cut off the entire bottom, because the split does go through the whole bottom, and find another piece of wood that is of the same type or matches with it, and turn a new bottom and replace the entire bottom of this bowl. So those are alternatives in, in the conceal category. Or you may go and say, okay, because this is turned green, and we enjoy turning green wood because of the way it turns out and the availability of wood, that we need to accept that sometimes it will crack. So in this case, we probably do many of the same techniques, but the idea here would be to emphasize that it did happen. So we may still fill it with epoxy or putty or uh, casting rosin, but here it would contrast with the other wood. It may be a distinctly different color or something totally different that emphasizes that the crack did happen, but that's okay. Or may again route it out or saw it out but the, the idea here would be that it would be a contrasting piece of wood. Even more drastic would be to what I would call a patch, where the distinction here being that it would not be a square or rectangular, it would be a more irregular piece of wood that would patch. And in this case, it might require a couple of overlapping patches to uh, cover the split. But the idea here, they would not blend in. They would be, at least in some degree, contrasting. Uh, example uh, that happens, uh, this happens a lot on is Hawaiian calabashes that was cited in, in one suggestion, where the end result is actually quite beautiful. The third category would be to emphasize the split. So we're going even further in this case. Instead of just filling the one crack that here's here about in, the, uh, in this portion of the bowl, once that's filled, do a corresponding one that's parallel over here so that it looks deliberate. It, it's evolving into a geometric pattern. Or go even so far as to do then another split, uh, another fill that is again a geometric, that forms a pattern or, or maybe even a random pattern, but disguises the fact that you had a split, or, but emphasizes the, the repair and what may come from it. Other suggestions were to insert butterfly keys over it, or pewas, or do wire inlay, and do other grooves and, and such. But the most extreme example that was received was to actually then to expand the, the, the project. In this case, the suggestion was to make a stand that actually then inserted into the crack and was then a stand for the finished bowl. That bears some further study. In the end, I think it's a, an opportunity to accept that, yes, this is green wood. It was living. It was breathing. This is why we turn green wood. So rather than saying that this is a, oh, no, it happened, maybe this is an opportunity to further express creativity and to further enjoy the process of turning green wood and making beautiful objects. 
Thank you again for your comments and suggestions. And if you see something different from this, add to it. We'll, we'll expand the uh, repertoire of alternatives here. Thank you.